यही ज्येष्ठ पांच र छ गते रेडिसन होटल लाजमपाट काठमांडूमा द क्रेट इन्डिया एजुकेशन फेयर भइरहेको छ प्लस टु पछाडि ब्याचलर पढ्न चाहनुहुन्छ मास्टर्स र अन्य थुप्रै प्रोफेसनल कोर्सहरु गर्न चाहनुहुन्छ र कहाँ र कस्तो युनिभर्सिटीमा गर्ने भनेर अनुयोलमा हुनुहुन्छ भने रेडिसन होटल लाजमपाटमा दुई दिने एजुकेशनल फेयर प्रोग्राम भइरहेको छ So you can see the great response, you know, students and parents have come in huge number to attend this fair. And uh, uh, the timing of the fair is such a wonderful time because now the grade 12 results, uh, these exams are over. Students are now free from the exams and now in search of right kind of courses and more information about the admission procedure. So this platform of the Great India Education Fair is very well timed and this is catering to the requirement of the students as well as parents so that they can make their career choice well in advance and decide on the various programs. So the response has been very, very encouraging. Good number of institutions have come here and I'm sure large number of students from Nepal will certainly benefit by interacting with the authorities of the universities and colleges. One thing which I would like to mention through your channel that this time, very unique universities like Thapar University Patiala, which is amongst the most reputed university of India, and even Modi University, Lakshmadgarh, Rajasthan. So some of the top universities, uh, Raffles University, Nimrana. So these universities have come for the first time, which again, uh, you know, gives a, again leverage and platform for the local students of Nepal here to capitalize on this opportunity and gain advantage of studying in India. This is, has started today and tomorrow is another day where the exhibition will be on. So certainly the viewers through your channel, I would like to give them a message. Take the advantage of uh, this platform, come and interact, you know, because this will widen the information of uh, parents and students. They would certainly learn more about various career options, its prospects, its job prospects, its scope after completing the program. And secondly, in case if they cannot make it tomorrow, right, which is the last day, we are coming back again in the month of July, which is 29th and 30th. So certainly that will be a time most expected that we are expecting the results of HSCB will be announced. So that will certainly give a lot of advantage to the universities of India as well as the students community. Prominent Service Private Limited le affairs Asia leading education fair organizer ko sahakariya ma ukta dui dini educational fair program sanchalan gar rahe ko See we are, we are one of the premier university of India. We are based out of a place called Dimrana. Uh, it's about uh, once you get down at Inter India, Indira Gandhi International Airport, we are just about 100 kilometers away from the airport. Uh, this is a very beautiful area. Just uh, it's surrounded by the all the Aravli Hills. You know the the Aravli Hills which is there. Apart from this, we, we, we are actually where a university got established under the uh, Raffles University Act 2011 uh, by the, uh, 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 in the Legislative Assembly of Rajasthan. So as far as the, all, all, all our affiliations are concerned, we are uh, completely up to the mark. Uh, and I can assure you that we are one of the places where you can, you can your, your ward, your uh, you know, student can come, come and study actually. Actually, Raffles is known for its global standards of education as well as when we go for higher studies the major question comes to the mind that whether this education is relevant to the times or not if it is it is said that why raffles then raffles is known for its strong industrial interface our education is state of the art and with the need of industries our curriculum is designed in such a way and varies every year to fulfill the needs of the industry because the ultimate goal of a professional education is to get a decent job or to offer jobs to others i mean say nepal ko admission office ko rupma nepal ko head office ko rupma ami kaam gardechau र हाम्रो ब्याकग्राउन्ड को बारे में बन्नु पर्दा खेरि हाम्रो संस्थाको नाम WRI ग्लोबल हो नया बानेश्वर टुरिजम डेभलपमेन्ट बैंक को पाँचो तल्लामा हाम्रो अफिस छ हामी चाहिँ नेपालमा इन्डियन एजुकेशन सेगमेन्टमा लगभग लगभग 7-8 वर्ष देखि काम गर्दै छौ अर्गनाइज्ड वेमा हामी 2010 बाट इन्डियन एजुकेशनलाई प्रमोट गर्दै छौ अब यो युनिभर्सिटी 
भन न कतिपय यूनिवर्सिटी तब को मल्टीनेशनल होना गई रह जबकि यह यूनिवर्सिटी अलरेडी मल्टीनेशनल इसको इंटरनेशनल कोलैबोरेशन तब को अलरेडी सो यह यूनिवर्सिटी को टीम को कुरा करने हो रैफल्स तब सिंगापुर में पाँच रैफल्स तब थाइलैंड में पाँच रैफल्स तब मलेसिया में पाँच इट्स सेल्फ रैफल्स इंडिया में सो हमी बेसिकली में एडमिशन अफिस को रूप में काम कर मानव प्रचार इंटरनेशनल यूनिवर्सिटी आप में यूनिवर्सिटी हो यूनिवर्सिटी होना का मोर देन एक्कीसवटा सब्जेक्ट भाग बेस सब्जेक्ट होने पर्व यूनिवर्सिटी हमीसंग इंजीनियरिंग मैनेजमेंट एप्लाइ साइंस आ आर्ट्स अभी तब कमर्स कोर्स अभी इंटरनेशनल कोलाबोरेशन का कोर्स हमीसंग धेरे कोर्स लगभग मोर देन पच्चीसवटा मेडिकल कोर्स अब तब को पारामेडिकल कोर्स हमीसंग है विद्यार्थी चाहिए कोर्स हम यूनिवर्सिटी हमी उपलब्ध कराई रहे इंडिया का विभिन्न प्रतिष्ठित विश्वविद्यालय का लेक्चर प्रोफेसर संग वन टू वन काउंसिलिंग में रही स्पट में एडमिशन सम्म को व्यवस्था कर उत्तर एजुकेशन फेयर प्रोग्राम में गई मौका को फायदा उठा सकूँ कार्यक्रम आज ज्येष्ठ पांच गते भोलि ज्येष्ठ छ गते रेडिशन होटल में सुचारू रहने Thapa University is situated in Punjab, India, and it's a 60-year-old university. Okay, we are ranked the third best in the private engineering colleges in India. Okay, and we have been in the field of engineering for last 60 years, and then we offer all the classical branches of engineering. As a graduate, whatever stream they are getting into, strive for knowledge is more important than strive for a degree. There are many institutions in the world which are giving degrees but not giving knowledge, and I'm proud to say that I am serving in a university which offers knowledge, not the degree. So the student should strive for knowledge, not for the degree. My request is, is like before taking an institute, just uh, I'll request them to go through the about the institute thoroughly, like what they want to do, where do they want to study, and where do they want to be standing after they complete the uh, the degree. Because the degree is just a paper. It's getting a degree is not a big deal. It's like where you study, how you study, and what you learn like about the outside world. So the, the student has to think about it. Of IMS Unison University, which has a 20-year-old rich legacy in the field of professional education. We offer courses in the field of management, mass communication, and journalism, and law. Uh, we have three levels of programs in our university. starting with the doctoral programs in the field of management and law then we have courses in the field of uh, uh, we have post graduation courses like mba llm uh, ma Ge journalism and mass communication mba also we are offering uh, uh, one is in the tr the traditional uh, courses like uh, marketing hr finance international business operations retail entrepreneurship and family business and there is a specialized mba that we uh, are also running which is called mba in communication our university first of all is an all women's university so we provide safe and secure environment in the lush green environment in the desert so it's and the excellent quality of education that's what the combination of safe and secure and excellence in education makes it the ideal place for young women to join our university